Telling jokes and having smokes Riding bikes all through the night It's a wild ride When you're being in Coffee ice no matter what Now you know he likes it in the butt It's a wild ride When you're being in Being in And life is shit but you're positive Let's find out what it's like to live a life Being Ian, being Ian With Jordan Why is my, this bat floating around? Because I gave it to you. You got socks? Yeah, you said here's this bat, which is like Yeah, your bat <laughs> Okay, fine <laughs> Oh, we can hang it today Oh, blow the show far Here we go <laughs> No, no <laughs> Oh, new one <laughs> Oh, you're getting good. And yeah. that's the start to being in with Jordan. I'm going to go to the doctor and they're going to be like, hey, what? you have a weird like bl pop blood cluster on your heart. Have you been blowing into a small horn? <laughs> have you been pushing a huge amount of air through a small yes. lamb's horn? And thank you for tuning in to another wonderful episode of B&E &E with Jordan. Do us a favor. Wouldn't it be great if you went to patreon.com slash b and &E oh. pod? Huh? Because guess what? What? We ordered a taxidermied rat. <laughs> we want to start getting more rats. That ghost almost looks like graffiti from the side. That's cool. Flip it on the other side. What do you think about that? Racist? We have a guest that here doesn't... today with us, folks. Wow. It's Mike Vecchione. He has Thanks. an incredible podcast. Uh, top three podcasts I've ever done. Yo, I thank swear to you. God. Really? Thank you. I was nuts that day. So were you. Yeah, we were going off. It we was were good. crazy. It was, it was really a good one. Now, it, what's the podcast? I it was fun. It's Mike Vecchione Investigates. I would love to have you on. Yeah. Um, we just, in, I investigate you a little bit what? and then we investigate topics together. After I investigate you, then we go into topics yes. together and Jordan killed it. Investigate. I, don't, I was like tripping. Like I hell. hadn't slept. I did mushrooms. I didn't do mushrooms by microdose. I had sunglasses on. I was freaking out. Is this during the And pandemic? I would say something non sequitur and he would just vault. And you? I was like, are you Get in out. this weird world with me? And he was like, what did you investigate on her? Um, Not on me. I just I I didn't know her background, how she started comedy, all this stuff. So we got into that. We got into Cousin her Peyton. mother. Ooh. You know, deep issues with yeah, her mother, like which I will not go episode. into here. Yeah. And then, um, and then we do stories of the day. You know, we go through the news articles and really try to like oh. figure them out through a series of jokes. Mm. Like he had a box that said "grease trap" on it. Uh huh. For oh yeah, Italian for Italians. People. It's like, racism against Italians. We were we yes. were researching it in Edmonton um, at that at the the big mall in Edmonton, the comic strip. In the back, there's a big sign that says "Grease Trap," and I thought that that was an ethnic slur Whoa. towards Definitely. Italians. Keep the Italians into one in in one bin. Yeah. Now, know? can I add something to that? Sure. As you, an Italian, you thought that that was an ethnic slur, mm -hmm. "Grease Trap." Mm -hmm. Now, in uh, <clears throat> the Detroit airport. There's a uh, shoe shining station, and it says Master Shine. Whoa. Now, is that the final boss <laughs> in a black video game? <laughs> Master Shine. Master Shine. Get it. Is a final boss in Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> <laughs> That's so... What was well, the, we're just saying it in the Italian stuff. What yeah. were you sitting on the other day? The shoe shine said Big Daddy and Small oh, Sam oh, or something? Oh, at um, Moon, Tower. Moon Tower at Antone's. There's a big, like, uh, shoe shining station. Shoe shining station. And First it was of like, all, a, he's sitting in it looking at Luke Monez. Me and Luke Monez. You know Luke? Monez? No, I don't. Oh, he's like he's six. A, he's like six, seven. Seven. Right. He's and they're tall. eye to eye. He's yeah. up in a thing, basically on. It was like a throne. It, it was, was a, a shoe shine. You show. feel like a king when you're getting your shoes shined. Yeah. People are servicing you. Uh -huh. You're up high. I don't they're think down it's low. okay to still have Family it. friend of mine in Delaware. I uh, came here from came Italy. Down. I hate that. Thing. I like it because it no. commands. Can I tell you what you it's like? I'm going to tell you what it's like. What? I'm going to say this, and I don't mean any harm. Oh, here we go. It's a milady cane that somebody who loves a princess bride would wear. Somebody with pinstripes and a fedora. Vecchione? Pinstripes and a fedora. I liked the other stuff. I kind of didn't understand. Okay. Thank you. That's okay. Thank you. So, do you but understand that's what I mean? Jordan's high level. Yeah. 
princess fun, bride, level princess functioning bride. autistic. What? <laughs> princess bride. His eye goes that way, not because of autism. It just goes that yeah. way. <laughs> I mean, that thing. <laughs> Leave it alone. <laughs> Two different drivers driving those cars. It's not true. It's because they're big. <laughs> and this, let me explain this for the all the readers. <laughs> There's no one reading. This eyebrow, look, is perpetually up from going like this, right? So it's uh-huh. stuck up. Yeah. So this eyelid's down, uh-huh. making it look like that's going that way. But uh-huh. they're not. See? Okay. You had me at stuck up. Yeah. Um, <laughs> can I say something back at the shoe shine? You guys move so fast. You have quick yeah. brains. I don't know if you're on... Whatever the kids are doing now, nothing. That's the up. scary part. No, you I guys drink are on the, nothing. On nothing. On nothing. God. Except for you know the cold brew concentrate. I swig that before leaving without the concentrate. I mean, I think the, it's the uh, cold brew and the high IQs where the yes. the brains are the quick brains are working. I but I want to say that. something about the uh, shoe shine. <laughs> And you alluded to it looking racist, and I agree with you. But that's why the shoe shine should always be done by somebody of the same race as the person yes. being yeah. serviced. Speaking of yep. God, racist, we're solving show problems, the ghost. guys. Here's what you do, right? Black guy, Mister, can I shine your shoes? Well, I'm a white guy. Tap him, white guy. Hey, man, can I shine your shoes? Right. White guy does it. Yeah. Black guy goes up. Can I, I, I get a shoe shine? Shine your own shoes. Guess why? Guess. Watch this. No, stop. Uh oh. Now it's at that height. Yeah, but you're first of all, oh. you're um yeah. you're <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Did you see that? Yeah. Did you see you that? You guys mind melted. <laughs> yeah. I, <laughs> you can take your shoes off. You don't need to be in the throne. Guess yeah. what? Maybe even better that way. But you're still working. The whole point is that Have you're you above working. Your load shoes, you're above working. I don't want to shine my own it shoes. I want to hire somebody to do. It I don't want to shine my shoes. <laughs> it feels. I've never got a shoe shine. Me neither. I'll tell you this. What I said earlier. Good family friend. Grandfather came over from Italy. Yeah. Shine shoes and shine hats in the city of Wilmington. Made their living and it became. Wow. I uh, independently wealthy from a shoe shine hat shine shop. Say that fast. Sh- made it made it mad. Same thing. Shoe shine hat shine shop. Shine, made shine, themselves hat, shine. independently wealthy from a shoe shine hat shine shop. Five That's pretty good. Shine. That's so really much. good. Yeah. Thank you so much. Red I think leather, you won the contest leather. quickly. Wet weather, yellow weather. <laughs> <laughs> can I right. can I ask a stupid question? How do you shine a hat? Yes. Well, I think I misspoke. I think it was hat cleaning. Hat cleaning. Hat, hat cleaning, hat cleaning shining. shining. Dustin hat. hats, shining sh- shoes. Dustin hats, next boyfriend of mine. Do you mine. ever see this? Dustin th- hats. That's his name? Nope. No. Well, did you ever actor. see the thing on the internet where they have uh, just uh, people, video from the 1930s, just people walking around? Yes. And everybody's in hats. Everybody yes. has those That's when, yes. that, that, when, great when shoes. They're dressed, dressed up. esteemably. Yeah. They behaved in esteemable ways. Right. I now, see. Now, you show up to court. Right. And people are wearing Looney Tunes shirts and their pajamas. That's not good. Yeah. You're already guilty. Yeah. Of bad fashion. Boom. I agree. Jury, Throw them in jail. <laughs> jury's out. The jury is the out. The jury is out. You need to clean that shirt. When I showed Get up to court, elbow. I always wore You got the good suits. hold on that elbow. <laughs> this elbow, uh, I you actually injured. Really? So, yeah, yeah. I'm holding you have it. You sharp as elbows. A, as a, um, yeah, it's good for. I have yeah. sharp elbows, <laughs> too. Yeah. Ooh. No. Yes. That is yeah. a herder. That coming down on somebody's off. face is rough. Yeah. Oh, dude. dude. Do you is watch that a segment? UFC? What? Is that a segment of the podcast? Yes. What? Dropping both. We drop no, elbows but on each other. If you want to tase yourself, I'll... we do allow that. We have a taser. We do have a taser? taser? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have a waiver? Can you grab it? That you signed? Because I would love to sue your Patreon. You got a waiver? You got a taser? You got a wing, my taser. What happened to the taser? Oh, it's plugged into the wall. Oh, grab it. Did you do that? That's so nice. And also, why does it smell like meats? Because uh, (laughs) you fed me a huge amount of meat last night. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, And it's seeping out of my pores. Oh, God. That's an actual taser? It's a stun gun. Oh, it's a stun gun. (sighs) Oh, Oh, my God. (laughs) Do it. Do it. Do you want to do it to yourself? Yeah. Look at this. Oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I got to join the group. Oh, oh. God. That shot up in my nutsack. Oh. The second ever. The oh. The second ever, the second ever guest to tase himself. Yeah. God. 
Thank you, Mike. Yes. Yeah. Number two. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is the X factor of any podcast. Right? Yes. I don't know why more people aren't doing that. Isn't that Do you amazing? Have pepper spray or other ways we can hurt ourselves? Oh, elbows. No. Oh my God. <laughs> pepper Isn't spray. That I think everything on a cop belt except the gun. Punch Whoa. Change it to the arm. The, 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 no, no, arm? no. I said punch, but not oh. elbow. No, your rings are scary. I'll take them off. No, I don't like this. No, I've been wanting to hit I you got for you a while. <laughs> All right, let me hit. Keep no. one ring on and punch her. That's an Alabama marriage. <laughs> Perfect. Ow! Oh, uh, that didn't even hurt. You're such a woman. Now, wow, leave that to a jury so to decide. Much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah no, that's well, a tough gonna be a hung oh jury on that. We're gonna one. need this Sherlock quick. on this one, boys. We're gonna have to have quick. a retrial. Not yep. enough evidence. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Stop it. This is a podcast steeped in felonies. I love it. Yes. Yeah. Have you ever been to jail? Uh, I got a DUI in '99. Yes. Yep. How old were you? Twenty. Say yes. Six. How, how old would you blow? And I was a teacher. I almost lost my teaching job. Oh my God, because you of it. should have, I think. No, no sorry about that. Wow. <laughs> I apologize. Oh my God. But kind of. I didn't know we had a parent here. How much did you drink? Two glasses of wine with some fettuccine? No, no, no. no. I, was, I, was, I was driving drunk, for, you know, dr drinking and then driving home. Dude. So, so it favorite, was bad. The most fun thing. But it was bad. I got pulled over. I got cuffed and stuffed. Were you? And, uh, I was driving. I went down. It, it was one of those streets that turned into a one way. I didn't realize it. Instead of turning I off, know. I just went, and then the cop lit were me up. Were you like fucking slam hammered, or were you no, like, I only buddy, blew, I made him. Yeah, I'm what'd fine. you blow? A one. It was a point oh eight. I blew like a one. I blew like two tenths over the legal limit. Oh, okay. No. Yeah. Not enough You're to lose fine. the job. So I did a ton of community service, avoided jail times, going through a breakup at the same time. Oof. She was a lawyer. And um, she hooked me up with another lawyer, but then she kind of was bailing out of the relationship at the same time. So that was uh, hurtful. I did She's that bailing to, out. Well, I she did that to bail Jack. You he out. got hit by a car. She did bail me out. Lawyer. Really? She bailed me out initially and then didn't, uh, you know, was kind of like wanted to leave, was leaving the relationship Amazing. at the same time. I got, I when when I got mine, they impounded my car and the night that I got my DUI, I had four months sober. And I like wanted to drink so bad. And I was like, all right, just go out and get a case of beer and a bottle of vodka. And I called this guy and I go in my head. I was like, all right, if I call and he doesn't pick up, I'm going to drink. I called, picked up after the second ring. I go, I want to drink. He goes, don't do it. I drank after being sober for a while. And I went out and I hit a family and I was in jail for 12 years. It's a bad idea. Don't do it. I go, okay, I'm not going to do it. Hung up. And then I go, all right, if I call this guy and he doesn't answer, then I'm going to drink. I always do that. <laughs> and I called another guy and he didn't answer and I drank. <laughs> but you didn't and then I got a DUI, but I blacked out. I woke up in jail puking, thought I killed a family and begged them to take me to jail to punish me for breaking sobriety. Oh, my God. What did you do? Huh? What did I you do? How did middle? you get caught? I parked yeah. in the middle of a four-lane highway with my right foot and the brake, my left foot out the window of the car and drive. And when the co cop came up to the Slow window. Slow down, because what you're saying is insane. Slow it's down. It's what happened. Say it slower. I parked in. <laughs> what do you, like, moving highway. The middle of a four-lane highway. <laughs> highway. Right foot on the brake, <laughs> left foot out the window, car and drive. The cop asked me what I was doing, and I asked him how he got inside my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. You oh, my not. God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and I'd you have eaten. <laughs> I thought I was and asleep cars, in my apartment. There's cars I'm like, why are you waking now, me what, up? What made you think that you could drive after just, because we all kind of know when we're hammered. It's like, dude, there's no he way I out. could drive. He there's no out. way I could drive. Where do you get the balls and the confidence <laughs> I to think that you could drive home? Balls. There's cars in your yeah, 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 I thought I was in my house. That is and insane. There was a liquor store down the road, and in my mind, when I left the bar, I went to you McDonald's. You asked a cop for a ride to the liquor store? <laughs> Let me finish it. Get more booze. Yeah. Wait, yep. you pulled over. Yeah. 
You're the you're only guy who's passed out on the middle of a four lane highway. Cop comes, you go, you know what? Party's not over. There's yeah. a liquor store yeah. 800 feet yeah. from here. Thank God let's you're get here. in. Well, I can't use my car because you're Wait. impounding it. <laughs> Wait, let's take you. The funniest thing to me is that you're driving down the highway and you're like, daddy's home. And you pull over. Like, you weren't crashed. You weren't at the side. So you were pulled over in the middle of it. In like the that. middle. Oh, my God. And I'll tell you this. There was a cop station. The guy, they walked me into the police department. By cop station, do you mean donut shop? <laughs> yes. oh, oh, that was a slam at you pigs out there. Yeah. Oi, goi, bitch. Welcome to the butcher. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're piggies. Um, wait. Oh. What did you just say before? What? Oh, they walked me into the police station. That's how far it was? Yeah. It was, you, I mean, I... I could not have part of a more precarious up? spot. Do you remember waking up? I remember waking up. Puking in jail. In the car going, uh, how'd you get in my apartment? And the next thing I know, I remember walking into the police station in handcuffs and I black out again. And then the next thing I know, I'm in a jail cell and I'm puking in a trash can going, throw me in jail. I deserve it. I killed a family. Dude, they probably and they're were like, laughing no, so no, you didn't. Hard. No, you didn't. Just get someone to pick you up. You parked in the middle of a four lane highway. No one got hurt. You 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 don't How have to go no to jail. How did no one get hurt? Can I say I something? How did no one because get hurt from that? Because there's an angel watching me wherever I, I go, and I'm here for a reason, and that's to make you laugh. Can I say something? Patreon.com no. slash Beanie and <laughs> If you, if I would like, if uh, there is a man with a mustache and tattoos pulled over in the middle of the highway, and he goes into a jail and he's going, "Put me in jail. I killed a family." I would like the cop to go, "Let's investigate." <laughs> Let's ask a couple more questions. Yeah. Rather like, nah. Yeah. No, I thought I killed the family in the car. Like, that's why I thought I was matter. in jail. It doesn't matter. I would be like, let's just double check. Oh, let's retrace your steps here. do you know that prior to that, I got kicked out of the bar. We because don't know Because they this. stopped <laughs> serving me, and I legit got kicked out wearing sweatpants <laughs> going, my money not real? <laughs> <laughs> That's why you don't wear sweatpants anymore. Wow. Yeah. Did my you go to sleep that real? night with no tattoos and wake up with all of these? <laughs> yeah. Covered. Covered. Ah, no, I went to jail I, and That's what happens in jail, I think. They, you tattoo yourself. I Is that not true? These are all they can't jail one night in prison. <laughs> they can't really do that. My, in prison, My yes. buddy had to pick me up at 5 a.m. What a good I, friend. I didn't call my mom. I didn't tell my mom about it until after it was taken care of, after I got the lawyer. Can I talk? I called my mom and she laughed hysterically into the phone when I was in jail. Laughed like this. <laughs> you know how I laughed? <laughs> so I thought that the phone was dead and I didn't hear her. And I was like, hello, hello. And she was like, I'm sorry, because she thought it was so funny. Because at that time in my life, I was 20. I was having intrusive thoughts that I thought I was going to hurt people. That's yeah. why I stopped doing construction with the nail gun because I thought I was going to shoot myself or somebody else with the nail gun and I was worried about airplane flights I had to get I'd love Xanax to read that review on the Better Business Bureau because <laughs> I was worried that I was going to pull open the flight thing and then that was my thing I was worried about being in a confined space that because I was had intrusive thoughts and I and then that night after like talking to my mom constantly flying to see my friend I end up in jail she thought it was the funniest thing in the world. She was like, you going to stab somebody now? You're going to hurt one of those ladies in there? With was your she tiny mocking pencil? you laughing? Yeah, 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 mocking you. Mocking me. Yeah. Thought it was hilarious. Right. Yeah, my mom didn't really find humor in it because she used to stay up to listen to see if I was still breathing. Oh, see, mine oh, okay. was always just stealing. It wasn't like, I mean, I got fucked up and I definitely, one time I fainted at the wheel because I was so high on weed. And I got, and I didn't know I was getting oh, period. Yeah, Can I jump in? I don't step? think I have a story as crazy as your your guys, but I would like to. Um, That's throw beautiful. My... I can't believe I've never heard that. That's what? crazy. I you pulled I like into to your throw, apartment. I would like to oh, throw yeah. my hat in the ring. Let's I took my bro my older brother by two years. He never hung out. Never hung out. He was two years old. So uh, it's my senior year. I like and that you we, teed that up. We go to a, um. You know, I'm just giving some background. Yeah, I do. We go to a. I bring him. To, I'm like, come out with us tonight. Come out with my boys tonight. Oh, I, I love this that. guy's. Bro, uh, my friend's brother's coming out. He's older. You're older. Come out. Like, let's. It's a pool party. My Who's friends cooler? Having a pool you were the brother. Uh, I was cool. Okay, got gotcha. Yeah, my brother was the sweetest guy. Really great guy. So we all Is go to the dead? party. Does, do you have his number? No, no, no. He's oh, okay. alive. Oh, okay. Because you were alive. like was. No, no, no. He was the coolest guy. Now he has a family. He's responsible. Uh, you know. Loser. But. Uh, <laughs> But anyway, he's not parking his car in the middle of a four-lane yeah, highway. I'll sure. tell you that much. Well, also not wearing guy's rings. Guy's got a family. That's 
Anyway, I um, we go to the party and I'm we're at the pool or having some drinks. We're like, oh, how's everything good? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go inside. I go inside. I'm playing like a, a drinking game or hooking up with a girl or something. I come back out and he's he's getting a little looser, drinking. Yes. Like, oh, yes. who's this? Yes. Who's that? Yes. He said. Yes. And so I go back in, come back out. Now he's really hammered. Woo! He never gets drunk. Yeah, he's drunk. he's yeah, really he's hammered. Drunk. I go, are yeah, you okay drunk. though? He goes, yeah, I'm okay. I'm having fun, man. I'm having fun. I go back in. I come back out. He's all wet, <laughs> which means he was in the pool yes! and somebody pulled him out of the pool. And, and, and so I take him home. I take He's him home. He can't, he, he can't even <laughs> speak wet. now. They give us a ride home. I can't even speak. I'm carrying him in the, our our house, our condo where body? we live. Yeah, I'm carrying him in. Carrying I'm, I'm him carry, in. I'm fireman's carrying him in to the, our place. My father is sitting up waiting. And my brother never gets drunk so he's not used to seeing my brother like that and my father goes what happened to him why is he wet why did he hit his head did he hit his head and my father like we're in i remember we're in my room my father takes me by the collar and jacks me up against the wall. He goes, you better start fucking talking right now. I want to know what the fuck is wrong with him. If he, is he hurt? And, and my hard. brother starts going, he can't even talk. He's so drunk. He goes, no, oh, because he sees my father's jacking me up. He goes, no, 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 no. He's okay. He's okay. And my father, and my father calmed down once he saw my brother being responsive. And then we, uh, we would, we were hanging out watching TV. We let him sleep. And every once in a while, my father would go, go check if your brother's still alive. <laughs> he loves your brother more. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. And rightfully so. God rightfully damn. So. That story was electric. Stop. stop. Make him stop. <laughs> that was great. Don't. I don't How like you having you? it up. I was 18. And the brother was 20. Yeah. Oh. He was 20. And did he we drink after that? We were both too young that? to drink. He not he never really drank. That's no, so after funny. That. He was more worried about the brother like being yeah. the record player and, is still going and not you. No, it's oh no, <laughs> you fucking lying bitch. <laughs> okay, could, could you guys leave that on the table in case? Absolutely. Wanna, yeah. Do it to yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love that. If you give do it, it one more shot. Wait, you I have to turn, turn it on, on for you. Flip the up and then click the push. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Wow, yes. that's a lot. <laughs> Give it's it like, one more. Third time's a charm. Do you want to know a secret, Becky owned? <laughs> oh my God, that hurt. Yeah, it'll grab Jesus, your muscles sometimes. Can I tell you a secret? God, that's that's better. You know what? That's better than coffee, though. Yes. I should get yes. one of those. Yes, right? yes. It yes. jacks you up. So oh my God, we should stand outside and charge people. I have to tell Becky owned something. When you're at the cellar, yeah, at McDougal, yeah. If you're holding. <laughs> Don't tell me the microphone does this same thing and you figured it out and no oh, one else Oh, the spot did. in the wall. If you're holding the, the microphone the and you touch yep. the exposed rebar, it zaps you. Yeah. In the lounge? your body. In the lounge? In no, McDougal. McDougal. Oh, There's McDougal. a little spot on the wall you can touch. And you you can it. touch it. Yeah. The first time I felt it, I dragged an audience member onto the stage. And it feels like this. Stop. It's not fun to do that. <laughs> it's fun for me. It's not. <laughs> Ethan. <laughs> Yeah, he's a child. No, you're not. <laughs> that thing is the X factor. Do you? <laughs> I oh know what God. you really want, so trade no, it. Listen, you story. <laughs> Nobody can hear you, so you're going to have to give me the taser. It's warm and hot, and I don't like it. So that's what you warm can and do. hot. That's what you can do sorry, if you want to feel me. that while you're on stage. It doesn't hurt. It yeah. feels good. I dragged an audience member the first time, and I was like, "Can you feel this?" And they did to prove that what wow. I was feeling was real because I didn't know it. How would you find out about that's it? That's like future it? crowd yes. work, where you bring somebody yeah. up and they feel something. They're like, ah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, "It's like crowd Clip work." It, post it, cut it. You <laughs> and you ask them questions, and when they answer in not the way you want them to, you tase them until they answer the right way. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Where yeah. are you from? Cooler, better. <laughs> Dude, I was watching some bad. You can't go down that road. What? When what? you start looking at I I bad I never scroll. Work? Yeah. Because I'm I, never I follow my friends. Yeah. So if I go to the explore page, it's raccoons, squirrels, everything I love. But yeah. if I go to my page, like my it's just now, it's where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you <laughs> where, 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 where are you from? It's so oh, it sounds up. like a, where are you from? Where, where are you, you from? from? What, 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 where are you from? Where are you from? I just did that. Like a rap. I just did that. <laughs> oh. I just did that exact bit. Oh, I thought you stuttered. 
No, I did a. Oh, you were doing it like a rat. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> I was stuttered. I was adding you just, on. You to literally, you. you did the same amount of where are you froms, and you did the exact same rap as me. But you can blame the taser for anything. That's that the was, beauty of having it. That was it. crazy. No, that I thought dementia. that you stuttered, and then I was like, "Here's an original idea." It's I, a when rap. have I ever stuttered? <laughs> You've st- <laughs> stuttered sometimes. Anyway, how did you guys come together? Did you guys just come know each together. other? From- yeah, how did you guys just knew each other from the cellar? I don't like it when you oh, smoke wait. down here when you don't ask the guests first. Open the window. That's fair. Do you mind if I smoke? Soon? Go ahead. Yeah, I mind. Do you have? Oh, a, you, you, are you going to touch mind? a child later? No. He's the. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Me neither. <That> so cool. <laughs> um. <clears throat> okay. We met. I opened for him. We met at Pine Box. He said. Oh, I think you're funny. I said, I think you're funny. Um, and then, whoa. Well, I thought I was about to say, I think you were dating Katie Hand again. You're dating Katie yeah, Hand again now. Hand. Eskimo yes. sisters. <laughs> I also <laughs> fucked Katie. Oh my god! Good for you. It was my hand Everybody's, again. Ew. <laughs> ew. Her name's Katie Hand again. No, we met. In Katie's the best. Katie do- talked me down a full ledge. Oh, dude, I should have said have her come. And Sarah, we got to have her and Sarah. Yeah, yeah. That'd be so fun. Absolutely. You know what? You weren't dating her. We talked about it. Yeah. And I remember it. Be, you being very, like, lucid about it. And you were like, we're friends. It's good. Yeah. yeah. And I was like, this guy's like a... When we started dating, we talked. Yeah. And yeah. that was great. That's yeah. right. Yeah. I remember and that. And Katie yeah. was lucid about it. And you were lucid about it. Yeah. And you were a maniac. And I opened for him. And I was like, this guy's nuts. But yeah. he's really great, and I watched him crush when I opened for him. Right. It was very cool. Yeah, I remember inspiring. that. That was at Stand Up New York. Yes. Yeah, yeah. That was yeah. Stand Up New York. R.I.P. No, it's still all right. Oh, it's still it's going. Still oh, sorry, what? I haven't been up there in a long time. You know Do you what? Guys it's work so there? fun for new jokes, doing Is doing it? new stuff. Yeah. It's, it's so just fun. so hard to get up there. It is hard. It I is. live all the way down. Not on the motorcycle. So yeah. Motorcycle. Motorcycle so changes fun. the game. I got here. Switch to a moped, you'd be popular in Italy. I One started on a people. moped. It's 40 oh. minutes to get here. I got here in Popular 25. Popular in Italy. <laughs> they have mopeds all over Italy. Jesus Christ, you're just hearing that? I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> racial slurs. Oh. No, no, no. Want to hear a good racial Edit. slur that I made up for Jews? No. Nickel, nickelbacks. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and Nickelback is Canadian. Yeah, is it? Nickelback, the band. Oh is Canada, yeah, is from Canada. Where there are no yeah. Jews. Je- Put that pimp, stupid. You know what it is like? It's like your skull, the skull with the hat. That's what it reminds me of. What's a skull with a hat? The skull tattoo with the hat. Those two guys. This. I'm gonna get you a new one. I do. You like this? I do kind of like it. Yeah. Can you admit that? It's then hot again, topic-y I'm wearing and '70s Lone Shark glasses. Those are awesome. Yeah, you look good in those. Thank though. you. You've been wearing those. They're making a comeback. No, yeah. I wore the big space ones yesterday. I'm trying to make Canes come back. <laughs> hey, did you ever have a guy on the subway walking with the cane, and then you get off the subway and he's walking faster than you? It kind of makes me upset. I'm like, dude, the cane is fake. If you're walking faster than me with a cane, that's have you a, ever um, walked with a cane. That's you a can PDE. Really haul ass. That's a um. You know, it's like steroids. You know what I don't like? Walking. These stupid cunts at the running park. Yeah. And they have a baby stroller. Yeah. And they're hauling ass because they're putting their weight on it. And I don't like it. Mm, And I try and lap them because I'm like, bitch, don't don't fucking pass me with your fucking baby. And what part of Roe versus Wade is this? (laughs) (laughs) This is is the Roe part. This is the running part of, oh, it's Roe. Yes. Because she's going to row, row. Mm. Finish it. I can't. I can't. Can you Jordan, do it for it me? It sounds like you want to be a mom. I do. Do you want to be a mom? A... But her body doesn't want her to have I one. I want to be the mom of a French bulldog or a Down syndrome baby. Do you see what I deal with? <laughs> yeah. Because I like that noise. <laughs> Just a happy face. <laughs> Legit, I was on a flight and I texted her and I go, Jordan, I know you say it. But you do not want a child with Down syndrome. There's a bunch on this flight, they're so and they're a lot of work. Are they? I was like, imagine me, but on I cannot listen to you. That's what it is. No, you imagine you with no mustache, looking at me lovingly, clapping loving. here and there. 
being so happy. Have yeah. you met one? I was yeah. on the train the other day and one was I was reading a book and he was just looking at me, looking at the book, looking at me, looking at the book. Right. They never grow up. They never grow up. Right. You get to be a parent forever. Right. I don't want my kid to out youth me. Right. I want to be the adult. What about forever. let's split the difference? What about a kid, a kid, but who's a pathological liar? I met a pathological liar. I thought you were gonna say a kid, but they're an ESL student. <laughs> Dude, that's what I think about when people. That's what I used to teach emotional no. support. I used really? to teach them. I have a master's in special education. Wait, well, I know we do stumbled. Your job. I know we stumbled into reality here, but I do no have a way. master's in it. Yeah. Do you have a so, master's in so it? So wait, master's were you working wait, with? So do I look, look like a guy who has a master's degree? No. In oh, anything? No. Oh my god! Do you? Do, so you like that? <laughs> oh, that was the wind, or oh, that was a ghost, and that clearly <laughs> says no ghosts. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's your old pal Ian here and I am talking to you about fume. We all have a bad habit or two, or for me, seven, eight, nine, ten. And uh fume lets you remove the bad while keeping the habit, making it a much easier transition on your brain and body. Uh it's an innovative device, replaces the nasty hand-to-mouth habit <laughs> you've been wanting to do less of. With no electronics, fume is completely natural, no vapor or harmful chemicals, just uses air, natural, delicious flavors like white cranberry and crisp mint. This is the fume. I already like how I do this, and it fidgets, and then it has a uh, chamber. For you to suck in the flavor, and the flavor I'm using is maple pepper. Uh, it kind of tastes like Christmas. I like that. It makes me think of a better time in my life. Anyway, uh, with adjustable airflow dial and movable parts and magnets for fidgeting, fume helps reduce stress and anxiety while you break your habit. Stopping is something we all put off because it's hard, but switching to fume is easy, enjoyable, and even fun. And I like how you can go, he, 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 he. Fume is over served, has served, ha ha ha, over a hundred thousand customers and has thousands of success stories. There's no reason that can't be you. Join Fume and Accelerating Humanities break up from destructive habits by picking up the journey pack today. Head to fume.com and use code SCA to save 10% off when you get the journey pack today. That's try fum.com. Try fum.com, T R Y F U M.com, and use code Scott to save an additional 10% off your order today. So join the fume team and fumigate your life from those terrible habits. Oh boy, I am excited to tell you about Babel uh, because I'm just going to get into the uh, nitty gritty of it. I I have I talked to a gal and she's Spanish and I want to learn Spanish so I can be like caliente and I'm going to use Babel to do that. I wish they'd Urdu. Do they have Urdu? Urdu is such a beautiful language. It's a it's an Arabic language. Uh Iranian, Pakistani, they some of them speak Urdu. Uh, but man, it is a beautiful length. Anyway, uh, okay. So if you're planning a summer vacation abroad, let me put you on my to go go to travel hack. It's called Babbel, the language learning app that has sold over 10 million subscriptions, and you can get a subscription by using our promo code SCA. That's right, SCA. Go to babbelcom slash SCA. B a b b e l dot com slash ska for 55% off your subscription. That's babble.com slash ska for up to 55% of your subscription. Babbel, language for life. I'm not done talking about Babbel, okay? It's created by over 150 language experts. The lessons are based on real life scenarios and you'll learn your vocabulary you actually use. No matter your learning style, Babbel is something that will work for you. In addition to lessons, check out their podcast games, stories, and live classes. Plus it comes with a 20 day money back guarantee. But Babbel is fun because it lets you learn in a fun way and it doesn't feel like you're sitting in your, you know, 
Spanish class back in high school and Senora Dermingen's getting mad at you because you're not putting accents on the right parts of the word. This thing doesn't get mad at you. It encourages you and there's no judgment if you're not doing it right. So I'm telling you, go to babble.com, B-A-B-B-E-L.com slash ska for 55% off your subscription. It would be really cool if you guys could learn a language and then we could all speak it together. Yep. And uh, also, it'd be cool if you used Babbel because we get money. So, <laughs> or as you say, dinero. Bye bye. So you have a master's degree. That was so funny <laughs> when fucking Jeremiah came in and was like, is there a ghost or did, did you guys just not move? talk about other guests? Sorry, while I'm I here? apologize. Oh, yeah, sorry. Sorry. I mean, you don't Jeremiah want to is bring great up and everything. Things you have no clue. Jeremiah. But this is my time now. He this could is my be an time ESL with you guys. Teacher. He's an ESL teacher. Is he? He what? could be. You couldn't How? be. You're an auto mechanic. No way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a shop teacher, Jordan. Yes. How dare you? Yes. How dare you? No. Metal metal shop or wood shop? Fabrication. Is that a thing? Yeah. What even is that? Fab? Sewing? Fob shop? Metal no, fabrication? Oh, metal fabrication. Now, wait. Sorry. Hold on. I forgot that What's you are- Are you part of IEPs? Roofing? No. <laughs> MIG welding? TIG Mid welding? TIG welding. Yeah. IEPs. I did IEPs all the time. Yeah. IEPs was in there. 18 pages, paperwork. You More don't want IEP. Law firm. Do you like Down syndrome kids? Love them. Better than autistic kids? I love them, but I didn't, I didn't teach them. Oh. Now, I love them, now, but I didn't teach them. Now, as a teacher that dealt with individualized learning programs, and uh, what was your favorite <laughs> kind of retard to work with? That's actually my question. That's a, is, I do want an answer What to was that the list. question? Which was your favorite type of retard do you like to work with? I like the kids with... Um, the kids who had learning challenges were a little slower that you had to help. Phil and, Hanley. And the kids with, Phil Hanley has a- um, Dyslexia. Yeah. Dyslexia, yeah. That's a good one, right? Because he has a good personality, but he just is like jumbled. Yeah, he's jumbled. He is jumbled. He's jumbled, but he used to be a model. So the hotness makes up for the learning disability. It's true. According yeah. to the- He probably um, slings dick scale. too. I can imagine him having a Hanley? huge pecker. Hanley's yeah, huge. Yeah, he does. I think yeah. he's probably huge. Yeah. But I it's, can... you know, metric system, so. Man, yeah, somebody... Canadian. He's Canadian. <laughs> So wait, uh, but I, I would deal with the kids who were like didn't fit in the other uh, classes and um, kids with emotional problems. They would flip out. That must have been so, how would you deal with that and not like lose restraints your patience? and mm. restraints? Can't do that anymore. Snuggles? Can't do that. Oh, you can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you can't have a flip out. The whole the whole uh, rule of thumb is if they're in danger to themselves, others or property. Then you have to like it's not in a public school. I worked in a, a behavioral school also, but you would have yeah. to you would have to restrain them if they were a danger to themselves, uh, an another person, or the property. What about the bully? We had one kid that got transferred from school to school to school because he would always. Yeah, he would, I remember one time he'd go around to everybody and he'd go, "You're fat, you're stupid, you're ugly," and I remember he got to me and I was too fucked up looking. Like he almost wanted to be like, "You look like you have problems at home," but instead just like skip me because he was like. Ugh, you're dumb. You know what I mean? Right. And I, I was like almost too bullyable to be bullyable. And he got transferred from school. Would you take care of that kid? Because that's crazy. Yeah, but there, there comes to a point where it's like that kid Doofy. can't even be contained in a public school. Yeah, you what have do to you go do to with special, that kid? They have to farm them out to a special behavioral school, which is very expensive. And they try not to. So until the kid raises so much havoc that he can't stay in a public system, then they farm him out. What to if a they don't private. have the money? This school district has that oh, they have cool. to provide That's it. Good. The IEP is a legal document. Oh, they cool. have to abide by it. Wow. So it's almost worth being bad so you can get into a private school. Well, it's not a private school. It's a behavioral school. And that's like different juvie? than a private. Yeah, kind oh. of. But for mental health. Like digging Let holes? <laughs> you know what I mean? When they throw it's you in a van. prison say, labor. <laughs> no, but I have friends who got thrown in a van in the middle of the night and then they had to dig holes for a long time. What? Wow. Yeah. This is in Iran? Oh, that happened to a friend yeah. of mine. They shipped her off to Utah. Yeah. For like a behavioral yes. camp. Yeah. A behavioral school, yeah. yeah. The behavioral school, there's some that are adjudicated to go through the courts and some that are just if you have word. mental health if you have mental health issues, it's not adjudicated. Yeah, it's but not what do you do with those court kids? ordered? I I taught adjudicated. in Brownsville, Brooklyn. You know what, Ian? The a, best you can. Brownsville, the best Brooklyn. You can. Let's have a real it. moment here without it. tasering each other or okay. ourselves for a second. That behavior would have got us into a um We'd have been adjudicated. Yes. What would you say? Calling Brownsville Brownsville because all the brown people? No. Somebody said, you're, Jordan. oh, Peter Ravello goes, what? He goes, you guys are close to Brownsville. And I was like, Jesus, Peter. And he's like, no, that's really what it's called. And I was like, oh. Yeah. I just they, there's a part of Wilmington called Browntown. 
Well, that's part right. of Philly called Germantown. You, though, There's no from... Germans within any radius. And of that's Germantown. a bad part of town. It's a rough part. Yeah. The Germans. Is it? Where Germantown. Is it? Do you know how many deaths there are a day in Germantown? Germantown? Nine. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. That's pretty solid. Mm. Thank you. Ow! <laughs> Good. Um, Carpal tunnel? No, oh, rings on a fag. Oh, rings. <laughs> <laughs> Ian, what was so? Are you married to the devil? What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> Why so many rings? I love rings. This one says ska. This one is a woman. You gotta put them on. Do you? You don't sleep with them on. No, right? I take them off. Okay. And and whenever Ew, I'm with a gal, I don't like your weird little whenever I'm with a gal, <laughs> they they see me take them off and they know it's time for business. Yeah. I so, want a guy to slide rings on when it's time for business. You oh, know what I mean? Wow. Get ready for. <laughs> This is a woman fingering herself, and it says, pleasure is power. This one I got on eBay. This is a that one's nice. three-ring circus. My mom uh, used to have that. This is uh, this. Oh, Let me wow. See that one? That at a Brooklyn um, uh, flea market. And then this one Jordan gave me. My stepbrother, Ryan Smith. Utopian Society or something makes those rings. Wow. Really good. It doesn't yep. fit me. Is that the marriage of the podcast? Like, if you guys ever decide to end the podcast, you will have to take that off? Whoa. We'll never end the podcast. It's welded to my body. Right. But do you have a similar ring symbolizing the union no, of the I podcast? No, I one. You should get me one. Well, maybe, no, maybe ring. Ryan what Smith ring should you? provide the, um, oh, your yes. stepbrother. Wait, where, where do you get extra large rings? Hey, I don't have extra large <laughs> hands. I have beautiful woman hands. Look at them. <laughs> oh. Can I see this one to tell you if it fits, and then you can get me one that's yeah. the same size? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um. <laughs> hey, speaking of rings, are you going to pop the old Q to the old K? It's getting down. It's getting down yeah, to it. Yeah, we've, we've, this is we, the size we've I need. talked about it. This we've is heavily the size talked you need? about yeah. it. For which hand? Can I tell? <laughs> <laughs> I think the second guest is a strong wind. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the second guest is really making his presence felt here. Can I? Can I can I tell you I like what you have because it's a thing of you you can I don't oh, like they make sketches together they're good uh, yeah I yeah. don't like when couples are together and they don't talk about like I feel like my ideal marriage proposal would be discussing about it later and then going why don't we just do this you yeah get, you know right. instead of like right. having to make it a big like are they ever going to know? Yeah. Do you, you know, she like, doesn't want, by the way, stuff. it's all about what she wants really for, for me. She doesn't really want like a big surprise or anything like she yeah. wants it to be talked about, to be yes. fleshed out. She yes. wants to be expecting of it. She wants all their families to be expected of it. She doesn't yeah. want it to be a Can surprise. I tell you something? That's good. She sure. wants to be surprised. No, look at me. She does. She wants a small. Surprise. No, Katie, you're speaking for yourself. Cause you're mentally. I will bet you. <laughs> I'm going to DM her right Mario. now. Katie. Yeah. <laughs> Katie's all right upstairs. I you? bet you. <laughs> is Katie upstairs now? I'll bet you a hundred dollars. Yeah. That if I'd be like, but do you want him to do like right now? Do you want me to do like a little surprise? You want him to do a little surprise? She would say yes. No, it's a little wouldn't. bit of a surprise. She doesn't yeah. want to be taken completely no, off guard no sports by sports game. No, she doesn't want that. But she if, doesn't want it in public. I know she doesn't. No, I know no, her. No, no. But she wants oh, it to be dude. like. She doesn't want it to be like. Hey. Here it comes. Right. She wants it to be like, dude, pass me that cushion in the under the cushion. There's a, you know what I mean? Right. Could you imagine? Well, I mean, I figured, can I just amend that a little bit? Yes, you because can. I have to put my own spin on it. Okay. Um, it's under the cushion and then I somersault in from the <laughs> other side of the room. Something athletic. Oh, athletic. You know, gotcha, I spent gotcha. years and years training and yeah. it just feels like a wasted opportunity. It is. Yeah. You somersault. You, she's like, what the fuck? You were a wrestler. Yes. You should Whoa. wrestle match her, and then when you put her in a cross-faced crowbar, the ring is on that part of the carpet right in front of her face. Do you watch UFC? That's, oh, my God, that's amazing. Right? Yeah, I just yeah. drop it. Yeah. 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 I'm shaking her face head in it. Like I've shake. got an arm bar in. Yes. I'm used to, I'm close to getting back points. Yeah. She looks over to try to bridge up to out breathe. of it. She yes. doesn't yeah. want to get pinned. Boom, the ring is there. Yeah. We're all winners. Yeah. Up, and then someone comes in and goes, you lost the match, but you won life. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's I it. volunteer Jordan to do that. I'll Jordan, would in. you ref it? Absolutely. Jordan, would you hide the ring where that chunk of food is in your tooth? Damn it. <laughs> Other side. There's always something. <laughs> I've been eating a lot of kale. Well, that's, but I you've been that leaving you probably, a lot there for later. Do you let the motorcycle? Do you leave the? Yeah, I smile. And then it, let me see it. And then the wind. <laughs> and then maybe there's bug. food. <laughs> all right. Sorry. Go ahead. That's all right. Sorry. Go. Here, let me get it out. This is every pod, just you know, like 
<laughs> oh god. I think we got it out. <laughs> Let me see. It's gone. <laughs> it's perfect. Oh god. Anyway, so what is the secret to a successful relationship with a comedian? Cuz I've tried it about 150 times and it ends in flames. It ends in flames. What's the c- 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 common denominator? <laughs> <laughs> Here. Irish dudes. I realize that I only you date don't like Irish the men. Irish. I only date Irish. You guys. only date the oh, Irish. That's guys. what it is. Think about oh, it. Man. It's their background. Holy shit. <laughs> only the Irish. Holy shit! Oh my god! It's wow. Irish people, not me. <laughs> 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 it's not because I'm on. You're well. single it's as you're fuck, Irish. dude, and you blew a guy last week. What? Shut up, <laughs> <laughs> you fucking bitch! Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> <laughs> Ian, is that true? Because Leave Tyler out of this. <laughs> you literally had an unsuccessful relationship with a guy this guy's gonna marry. Shut, shut up! up. <laughs> shut the fuck up! I will fucking end you. <laughs> anyway, why am I single? <laughs> It's not because you lash out. Or, no. Well, no. I, it's not the rage. No, there's people who, there's people who like that. There's people who will like that. Do they? Yeah. Really? The lash out? Yeah, Mike used to teach out. them in school. <laughs> <laughs> it's called a basket hold. I grab one of your arms, one of your arms. I sit there. I de-escalate you. Really? How yeah. do you do that? I go, hey, look, you're not getting up. You have to calm down. Stop struggling. <laughs> stop struggling. Jordan, stop struggling. You're not going anywhere. You're not stronger than me. You're, you're, you need to calm down. <laughs> and really? Then, and, then, and then tell and then that? tell me your wrists hurt. My wrists hurt. Okay, look, if you stop struggling, I'll stop struggling. That's how it works. <laughs> okay, fine. And then I go like this. <laughs> yeah, no. Then it's it's usually a headbutt, and then that that makes me bleed. Yeah. I used to have to be restrained so much in school. That's the most fun. We're like, I'm calm, I'm calm, I'm calm. <laughs> they're so much bigger than you. Oh, uh, that's the most fun game in the world. My mom used to play a game called No Kisses Today with us, where we'd desperately try and give her a kiss on the face, and she would stop us but like this. <laughs> and it was. Oh my God. <laughs> That's the ultimate yeah. scarring of a child. It's because they're Irish. <laughs> You're Irish yourself? No, I'm I'm Italian, yeah, remember? It doesn't work out because they're Irish. Oh, that's right, 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 your mom. <laughs> Go kiss me on some food game. <laughs> it tickled your mom. My that's mom, very that's very un, that's very unlike Italians. They just like no, St. Patrick too No, there was too no much. affection, zero affection. Now they want to be affectionate, these right. fucking cunts. My Grab you by my the mom. cheek, pull you in. Oh, God, Grab you by no. the cheek, pull you in. No, my grandfather's very Italian, but he was like the... Is he still alive? Well, they were affectionate. I was very fat, and Italians don't like that. Italians no, love that. Italians, Italians love that. that. I have hot Italians. Italians hot, hot want Italians. their daughter to be fat, so she no, no, no one no, will no. like her, so yeah. she just stays home and takes care of the family. No, I thought that was a sign of fertility. Yes. No, not to these guys. No? They're athletes. Oh. You're you're wrong side of the track. Grandfather yeah. was hockey coach. Mother was hockey coach. Sister was hockey under all hockey. Me, fat Molgoth in the food court. With the Causing heart of a trouble. hockey fighter. Yeah, but, yeah really. <laughs> With the heart of a goalie? <laughs> yeah. 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 God. Yeah, she was a goalie because there were no sweets you... getting by her. <laughs> not one. <laughs> Still to this day. No cakes. Um... <laughs> I had to throw the nest quick today because I was eating. But you, it dry. you're working through all this in therapy, right, Ian? You're in therapy. <laughs> you're in therapy. You're hilarious. You're not- I am working <laughs> no? in therapy. <laughs> I am. I am working through my rage issues. That's what we talked about yesterday. Oh my stop. God. I will stop fighting when you stop. <laughs> all right. Okay, okay. I will. Your wrist hurt. Wow. Yeah. Now what do you say? <laughs> <laughs> I'm liking the level of aggression on this pod. This is the most aggressive podcast I think yeah. I've ever been on. It's very anyway, aggressive. Me and Alan are working. Great on song it. by yeah. Angel. Though. I'm Alan. The Alan. Alan is a savior. He says I, love him. I take out my anger on people who don't deserve it because I don't take out my anger on the people who do deserve it. Do you think Ian's the recipient of that? <laughs> yes, <laughs> all the time. Yeah. Oh, you did. I thought I was on speakerphone earlier when I screamed at him. Whereas I thought you didn't hear that. I was no. taking a shit at the ball. <laughs> he calls me and I'm like, I'm on my fucking motorcycle. I said, don't call me when I'm on my bike. And he's like, I didn't know you were on your way. And I was like, I texted you and you're like, you didn't. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. And then I yelled at a little Jewish. When you're with a man, Jordan, and he goes to kiss you, do you put your hand out in his forehead <laughs> and he goes, 
Dude, have, trying to give you love. No kisses trying to give you love. She doesn't. They so hope she would. Fun. It's so fun. What? Try playing it with no Katie. No kisses? We'll say, we're going to play a game called No Kisses Today. Try your damnedest to kiss my face. You'll end up in this position. No. He was like a D1 wrestler. Yeah. He's going to break no, her neck. Katie, Katie is very like um, sharp. Sharp, and she goes. She goes. We're not going anywhere until I say I love you into your mouth twenty five times. I go. No I one's love, got time for that. I mouth. love you into your mouth twenty five times. Oh, that's God. so nice. I love it though. Is wow. it OCD? <laughs> yeah. I love you. I love you. I love you. Yeah. 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 It's an OCD. That's if I say so I love you twenty five. No. Nothing. Where's the taser? Jordan, there is something, and you said nothing. <laughs> <laughs> do you have, thank you. Mm -hmm. What does Alan say? Alan's got to be. Do you go to Alan? No, I okay. am wanting don't, to fix don't. myself. <laughs> that was cool. How that Jordan does worked. Alan say that you're emotionally unavailable? But Alan you're emotionally says, available. Alan literally started crying the other day because I reminded him of a patient who was in solitary confinement who then had to go to the infirmary and a nurse reached out and touched him and he burst into tears because the affection. He thinks that I'm very damaged from my childhood and therefore the only affection I'm able to receive is aggression. And you're therefore, paying him money for the obvious? Therefore, I cry a lot. Yeah, I know, and that's In good. there. That's good, but, you know, I'll fucking do it for free. Everything he's told you, you I've told suck. you. suck. <laughs> and <laughs> you just broke my arm. Good, that's, you had to be restrained. <laughs> and I learned from Michael. So, Basically, if a guy is into me, like if he's nice to me and yeah. sweet, I'm like, Ugh. you don't like that. So Alan says I, the next person I have to date is has to be somebody who it makes me feel like that. That's not easy. Yeah, but you have to adjust your expectations then, right? Yes. I wonder. I just came from Alan and I wondered why one of the cushions was chewed. Yes. So it must have been <laughs> you had just been previously there. You go to Alan? Yes, I oh, go to Alan. I really Yes. Do you go every week? I'm doing a, an impression that I'm doing um, Soder's impression of Alan. Oh. Yes. Is that what he does? Is of course. Oh, wow. Come on, Holy Jordan. shit. No, He's no. An it, do it, do it to where Jordan would recognize it. Stop. <laughs> Enough. <laughs> He's like, I can only take so much in 45 minutes. <laughs> And how do you I, fight? The, how do you I, fight I, the demons, even? I have I have to go to therapy after I give you therapy. <laughs> <laughs> Not enough medication can fix. You know the what we talk about a lot? My, <laughs> my faggy friend. <laughs> oh, I didn't know you talk about. Yes, we do, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Ian, how do you get the demons out? Huge amount of pills. <laughs> no. Uh, you have like eight meds. I am on medication. How much? Right. Because I have a chemical imbalance with my brain and I accept that. <laughs> and that if Your I don't eyes. take my medicine, <laughs> I can revert back to a really dark place. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, it sounds like you slowed it down and sounded like you were talking to a judge. <laughs> I have to take my medicine because I have a chemical imbalance. <laughs> no, we both true. we uh, both have a bipolar. It's I have bipolar too. So it, yeah, it's too. a thing of <laughs> I went bipolar. Helps. And you went bipolar too. <laughs> the uh so my extremes the medication helps in terms of like my extreme mood swings right. aren't like this. They're kind of like this. Yeah. And it dulls the edge of the extremes. So I still have them but I'm more focused and can understand when they're coming, why they're coming, and then I can deal with it rather than just being so dysregulated right, right, right. that I just don't know how to deal with things. Yeah. And so it's really... I'm not dysregulated. I'm, I'm medicated. I'm doing great. But yours comes in the form of anger, Jordan, right? I have rage. I fight a lot of yeah. people publicly. Not public, but like at airports. I used to do but you're that. Such a nice, you're such a nice person, though. Not if you do something whack. Like Everything if you... Cut you in line? Do yeah. everything that you do, I used to do. And I have shut up. I'm a whole person. What? Don't say that. I am a grown up, and you're it myself previously. Ew. No. That's like if you. That's like if you say something like, 
I don't know. My sister exactly. always says that shit. No, I'm not going to end up like you, and I'm not you. I'm a different I'm, person. I think what she's saying is um, your gender is not as good as hers. Yes. I have a worse it's, gender, actually. Oh, it's I, so you don't know what it's like. Never and, said and that you're going to end up like me. You do get in fights now still. I'm empathizing and saying the way that you feel sometimes, I have felt, and I have been able to handle it and move we forward. We have very and that's different something. scenarios. Yes, but... You have more mental imbalance and I have more childhood aggression. And at the end of the day... Yeah, well, I don't like this it, whole, I'm a little older than you, so I'm your therapist. It I'm sucks. not. You do that all the time. Because I'm trying to empathize you, and say that and I understand what you go through and there's a light at the end of the door. All Jordan, the listeners Jordan, know. Jordan, can I call you out? I think, yes. do you like secretly like to be talked down to? Not by Ian. Be oh, okay. Not by Ian. No. But sexually, yes. Okay. But wow. not by Ian. You mean add a little sex to it? Huh? No. <laughs> I used to be where you were. Stop. <laughs> On my back, <laughs> getting railed. Gross. But better. That is better. <laughs> you sitting there. You yeah, sitting he did there. add sex to it. <laughs> yeah. He did add sex better. to it. You Ow. sitting there with a Fred Durst hat in a fucking basement and saying to me, I used to be like you is the worst. Old man, take a look at my life. I'm a lot like you were. <laughs> when I'm your age, I'm going to have two big dogs and a husband who's in the trades. Lumberjack husband? No, not lumberjack. Oh, okay. Something better than that. Like a plumber. Yeah. Electrician. Has union? Not or scallywag. Union. Jordan, gonna, yeah, Jordan's going to have a, a fucking iron worker that comes home and she's going to be like, now get in this bed and take well that cock to this pussy <laughs> or else you ain't getting any overtime. I'm not like that in bed. We both know I'm like a little Hasidic wife in bed, okay? Do you become aroused at overalls? The guy has overalls on? No. Oh, if that was the case, I did she'd be run wet into all the time you had an overall at the gutter. Yeah. And he had the Carhartt overalls, and I was like, we, we, we got to stop talking right now. <laughs> we got to get away from each other. Who was it? I'm stuck. Oh, ho, ho, ho. he had the overall, the car. Oh, ho, ho. But he's a hottie. Who is it? Jack. He know doesn't Jack. know him. I don't know Jack. No you one did. If, you would if you would see him. Okay. No, he's a little squirrel. Hot guy. All I'm hottie. saying is that I, you always tell the story about how when we went on that one row gig, you were driving. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> you were I driving. didn't even know I was doing it. I didn't even know I was doing it until you were quiet. <laughs> go ahead. You were driving and you were like, this kid is such a mess. He's shaking. He's this. He's all over the place. Kid. It's I kind of scary. Right. Sorry. But when we did that gig, I was your age where you are now. And I was a mess. And I have worked really hard to arrest it and see it. And I've become way more level-headed, way more at peace. And it comes with age and a lot of hard work. And what I'm saying is you are enacting the steps now to get to a place where the mess that is in existence is slowly getting cleaned up to lead to I, a very regulated life. That would be a nice thing if that's what you were saying. But That's what I am saying. Well, you can't just amend it now because the rest of the podcast was you saying your therapist needs therapy. You're a crazy person. No, I said your therapist needs therapy because you. Your whole you. narrative before I that. I was going for the joke. I know. It's a comedy podcast. Not compliment pivot. friend with a pivot. guy on the couch. You can't pivot like I that. I pivot. You I can't. pivot. Well, you'd have to tee it up if you were going to pivot like that. Otherwise, well, it fucking sounds like you're like. Four, bitch, because it's teed up and I hit it <laughs> out of the park. Well, now, Mike, you, you get a special. Again. Again. Tell okay. us about it, dickhead. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, the special is called The Attractives, and it's really? on YouTube You named the special free. after us. Yes, The Attractives, hot people. It's hard for us. And uh, it's The Attractives <laughs> on YouTube for free. It's at over one million now already. Mm. So please watch it and share it with everyone you know. I'm depending on it's, um, uh, How the long people. has it been out? Not one that month. long. One month. One million over? One month. Oh, that's huge. My yeah. God. That's huge. Yeah. So that's it's doing good. It's really, really good. Nate Land on the Nate Land homepage. Directed and produced this by your by your boy uh Nate Bargatze. He did a fantastic job. Eight hundred pound gorilla. So I'm thrilled. Oh, we're pro eight hundred. Pro eight hundred. Wow. Yeah. That's okay. amazing, man. Yeah, Wait, they did a wonderful Nate job Land, on it. Does that mean it's like relatively clean? It is clean. Oh, it's completely yeah. so clean. Impressive. It's clean, but it's not like uh because yeah. clean comedy is boring and sometimes 
corny. And it's not that you guys. Yeah, but you're I not like corny. comedy so it's much. It's not better. that. It's, you're you know, you're not a New York corny. comic. Yeah. Yeah, you're New York clean. Right. Which means you are Boise dirty. <laughs> <laughs> it just means intelligent. Yeah. It's tricky. Yeah. You and I can't do it. No way. Nope. There's a couple types of clean. There's punny clean. There's like, oh, that's clever clean. I'm punny clean. And then there's like, I'm looking at the shit that we look at every day and making it funny clean, which is that. That yeah. is the best and Nate's most like desirable like form that. of yeah. comedy I yeah. wish I could do. Yeah. What right. you and Nate do is well, you so could do like, it's, it. You could do it. It's a choice. It's like you guys are have the skill set. You just don't want to focus on it, which I get. Yeah. So it's like it's just what you're focusing on. Yeah. I just focused on that, but I wanted to be I wanted to have like city energy, which is punchlines all the way through. You know how yeah. we do it here. Yeah. And then just, you know, do it. But, dude, uh, your way, ability you know? to take stuff and dissect it and chew all the meat off the bone of the most mundane thing is something I admire so much in the sense that, like, I think I'm done with the thing, and then you go five layers deeper. Right. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. that, I, I mean, I, I Nate does that, obviously. You know who else does that? Josh Blue. He, yeah. like... I mean, how many years can this guy talk about having cerebral palsy and reinvent it and make it funny and new and it's like the funniest thing ever and he's just taking something we all see and just right. dissecting he's to unreal. the point of like, this is how many layers of the microscope yeah. are we under right now? And you do that too and I admire it so much. Thank you. And you're buddy. so good at it. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Such a funny Thank you. comic. So, um, that whole crew, Dusty, yeah. Nate, yeah, those guys Aaron are really Webb. funny. Yeah. Funny. Yeah. So it's uh, it's out. It's it's very good, and uh, please, oh fuck, please what? please watch it. We we haven't been recording this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine that would be fun. Good prank. Yeah, it's I watch it. It's really good. I usually don't watch specials. Is it on Thank your you. YouTube? It's on Nate Nate Land YouTube page, nice. but it's on mine also. And you, and you it's really? On, it's just yeah yeah. You've been Is going everywhere with it. Or no, just on both. It's on both. How does that work? Do you? Does, I don't know the technology. I have the, to have technology people to is do it, it. Is it one? If I watch it, is yeah. that going to view going to go to both specials? I don't know how that works. Well, is one special have X it's, amount of it views? It lives on his page. Let me put it that way. Oh, you re? Yes, yes. I re, gotcha. I think I reposted gotcha. it on mine. Yes. but it lives on his page. Yeah, because awesome. it's his. He directed it. He produced it. So it's on his platform, which I'm happy because uh, he has a huge yeah. platform. Yeah, that and he's rules. great. Yeah. So I appreciate Nate the, uh, is the one who told me to move to New York. Yeah. I lived in Nashville and he was like, you got to get the yes. fuck out of here. Oh, wow. Now and he's was, doing the opposite. He's trying to get everybody to come to Nashville. Well, he talk to like, him he now. He'll be like, come back. to Nashville. Yeah. He moved back and he was like, I have a kid. He was like, I just did my dues in New York. Yes. You got to. He did. And in his credit, he moved. He once he exhausted New York, he's like, OK, I can't do anything else here. He went to L.A. and then he moved. Like he did not stay. He was like, once I can do, once I did everything that I can do in this place, I'm going to the next thing. If so I didn't have a podcast, smart. it would be really, I would be very tempted to spend a huge amount of time in LA. But what would you be doing in LA? You that's would the, that's hate question hiking. I hate. You would hate hiking. It. I love LA. Yeah. I hate the crowds. I gotta go there in two weeks. You wanna go? Yeah. Really? How long are you there? A couple, four days, five days. Yeah. That'd be Get sick. Get me the fuck out of here. Yeah. Can I do the things you're doing? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> oh, that'd be so fun. Is it weekend or weekdays? For a minute. What? <laughs> weekdays. Yes. Yeah. What? Yeah. Not Mother's Day. No. And I'm getting tattooed the 23rd to the 25th. 23rd to <laughs> the I kind of like it. Yeah. Yes. We're now going. Say, mommy loves you. <laughs> loves you. Mommy loves you. Yeah, I love you, mommy. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Well, where do you go from here? Do you think that you'd prefer to say to a woman in bed, good girl or bad girl? Um, You're a good, good girl. girl. You always want to encourage. I say, I'm it. proud of you. What if she's being a bad girl? Yeah, if, <laughs> sometimes that's really the that's case. That's better. That's better. Sometimes these it. girls are being bad and yeah. they need to be disciplined. Yeah, yeah. But I look right in the camera and make eye contact with the fans uncomfortably. It happens. <laughs> girls are bad in bed sometimes. You're being a bad little baby girl. <laughs> Ooh, call an attorney because we're gonna have a slip and fall. <laughs> God, oh, I'm slipping in. All it's a waterfall. Low you know income I mean? whites who uh, watch this show are aroused. Yes, are they low income? Who do you have coming to your shows? Yeah, Dude, what's your demographic? Yeah, quite a few Spanish. autistic people. Hispanic, the Spanish, gay, trans girls, and boyfriends. I 
love the it. The boyfriends are dragged there. The, the boyfriends girls, are dragged the girls, there. The girls bring. Yes. Yeah. And the guys bring their guy friends. It's like the best. Wow. I fucking love it. Yeah. A lot of blacks too. Big fit. Big. We love the blacks. <laughs> <laughs> do you stage dive at the end of uh at no the end? but i almost did once wow yeah i got a standing ovation you carry them back to plate. your merch that would be amazing <laughs> <laughs> oh dude inside when joke. i shoot my that's special great. that's what's gonna happen yes. that's great that's what's gonna happen can i get a producer credit on it yeah. for the idea we i gotta end the show now Hollywood. thanks mike it's <laughs> <laughs> i don't think Camera you should crosser. have in your special you stage dive and then sell t-shirts you should stage no, dive that's out after, to smoke a that's cigarette. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. yeah. Co-writer credit. Yes. I got a credit. See, if you're going to go to L.A., you have to think of these things. You guys are going to be there. Where are the credits? Yeah. Yeah. Can yeah. I get a credit on that? What are we doing Can in I L.A.? A, we're going to podcast. We're going to get tattoos. We're going to hike. I'm renting a car. I got to open for a tell at Hollywood Improv, but you can come hang. He'll give you a guest spot. Will he? Yeah. Are It'll you guys going to support the writers or all? Or? No, no. no. Fuck them. What the hell? They need no. to grow up. Yeah. Fucking deal the with AI f- or suck my your- fat cock. Oh, that's why they're upset? Yeah. We should support them. Yeah. God bless writers. Support hey, the writers. Them. Are we going to? Hey, I don't know, because guess what? We didn't write any of this shit, and this is funnier than any of the bullshit they put out where they, when they go on an improv hours strike. a day. Improv strike on we'll a be, fucking Zoom we'll show. Fucking yes, Zorba and the playing. Queen or whatever new fucking shows are coming out. Right? I didn't listen to what you're saying because I was thinking about an improv strike and them all playing zip zooms <laughs> out at the strike. But aren't they blocking trains and stuff? Like standing in train. I saw a video. No, of that. that was for a different protest. Oh, that yeah, was for the choke guy. Yeah. That's yeah. right. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Choke guy. Um. <laughs> here's the question. Yeah. AI. Yeah. What do greatest they- basketball player of all time? <laughs> <laughs> that was a crossover. Go. Oh! Ooh. Go too fast and break your ankle. We just talk about practice. <laughs> Is he doing black voice again? No. It's no. Not freaking, no. Iverson. Yeah. Go ahead. AI. We talking about practice? We, we talk, talk about, about practice. practice. What is going on? We talking about practice. We talking about practice. Not the game. We're talking about practice. practice. <laughs> and communists, they like to talk about praxis. <laughs> What's happening? Somebody, somebody help. You need oxygen in this room. Sorry, I thought you were talking about practice. <laughs> anyway, are people using AI to write sitcoms and stuff? Yes, it's, they wrote three episodes of Succession with AI. Did, Get the no. fuck out of here. Yes. Wait, did, really? Yes. yes. No That's way. really a thing? Yes. No way. I didn't think it was that advanced yet. Look Whoa. it up. Wow. On the, fo- the phone's going to lie to us. It's part of it. It's a yeah, robot. Yeah, is it going to lie? This phone has to leave and fucking stand in the middle of the road for construction. <laughs> Isn't it cool? If it flies off, it, it stays so, right? yeah. It moves the stop sign to tell people to stop and go. <laughs> Isn't it cool? All right, we got to wrap up. Okay. Where are you going to be? I'm going to be in Chicago May 26th and 27th Zanies? at Zany's Rosemont. Yes. Yeah. Love it. Please come out. That's the I need one. people coming out. The Rosemont one. I've, I've done the downtown I one for years. I like downtown. Oh, downtown's gritty. It's I great. I love Rosemont. Downtown's yeah? my favorite. Yeah. Well, I'm going to be there March 26th, 27th. Uh, follow me on all March. social media. I'm sorry. May 26th, 27th. <laughs> Thanks for catching it. Yep, May yep. 26th, 27th. I didn't even also, have to restrain you, you fucking <laughs> retard. <laughs> oh, sorry. Also, um, Nyack, um, Levity Live. Me too. Uh, June 6th, 7th. Me too. 8th. Same dates? Same dates. <laughs> Double booked? Co-headlining? Oops. <laughs> 6th, 7th, and 8th, uh, Levity Live in Nyack, New York. Please, those two dates, I need people. Yeah. Please come out. The special Mike. is called The Attractives on YouTube. Please watch it and share it. At Comic Mike V on all social media platforms. And Mike Vecchione Investigates um, on the Gas Digital Network. But you could watch it on YouTube live Wednesdays, 6 p.m. So fun. So Thank you guys podcast. for having me. I really appreciate it. I want, you on, I want you on my podcast if you have the time. Yeah, oh. sure. Jordan. We'll come together. Yeah, we'll come together. You come together, absolutely. Right now. I didn't know if Jordan wanted to do it because she oh, already did me. it. I want to do it. Yeah. Right. But isn't it early in the morning, though? Yeah, mom. We can do, oh, we're doing Jimmy We can do whatever you want. Okay. Thursday. I know. They texted me. I need I to. Great. You need to do it because last time Get you didn't show up. Kitty Kane. I will stop Kitty Kane if you come to Jim and Sam. Fine. Can I not do 
the one tomorrow, then. We are doing that tomorrow. You <laughs> cannot back out on things you agreed to do. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And the adult relationships don't work out because it's not because they're Irish. You're mentally ill. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Being Ian with Jordan. We love you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>